maybe I'll do it again, bitch. You see that fucking balloon, bro? That's gonna be your head next time. Give us a hot take. What do you want a hot take on, dude? It's fucking beach day tomorrow, man. Hey, fucking come back, man. Oh, we're gonna go look at Reddit. I'm gonna get a hot take. Let's have a look. Let's have a look at uh, what, what dumb shit has been said today. I remember reading something this morning. I just can't remember what it was. Uh... Oh, you so hot. I swear I read something on here this morning. Maybe I didn't read this this morning. Am I high? Did I dream about this? Maybe I'm dreaming about these guys because I love them so much. Oh, that thought was good. Maybe. What about me, Curtis? Yes. I actually can't remember what it was. Man, you ran me over. Fuck you. I didn't run shit over, bro. Uh, That's true. It was Rami. It was Rami. It was Rami. Come on. Man, that fire. Ooh. Bam, 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 bam. Is this actually a thing? Like to I want you as viewers, and I never want you in my community or any community I'm a part of. That's some fucking. That's some weak ass shit, bro. Oh, it's snowing. Look at the coke on the ground. Wait, do, do people actually see some shit like this? I feel like our chat says some dumb shit, but they would never, uh... Never say some real dumb shit. You ready to get the pen and all this stuff for me? As a queer person. I feel like it, I feel like um, this word here was used as a negative more than the right terminology for it when I was in the 90s. But I guess you could say that for all the uh, other slang. I can't imagine um I can't imagine that being like a thing that would last in this chat. Like my mods are some of the biggest assholes on the planet. But you know, they're not gaping yet. Submarino. This is um, it's the submarine interior. Put it somewhere. I can like sleep there. Bro, it's gonna be fucking. So there could be like um, a similar style. This would feel more like a Rainbow Six than a Tarkov, I think, right? Because it's you gotta go from A to B. Whereas like the server room's more like Tarkov style because it's there's no A to B linear, right? You know what I mean? Like, no I was gonna say this would be like a James James Bond one. You know what I mean? You have to. You have to wait for the guard to do the right thing, then you shoot them in the back of the head. Or you can go in full crazy, but the AI's like, you know. 
powerful. Oh, here we go. Here's the drama clip of the day. Am I in a car? Yeah, they have him kidnapped. Honey. I don't know where the other guys are going or what they're doing. Going to Maldini's. Uh, <laughs> Charles is around somewhere. Oh, if I get shot, I love you, my man, okay? But yeah. tell me I want to come back. Um, can you change you can no, kill, pay me kill, out of no, the company so, so I can just get lockpicks and shit? I wonder what the uh, the prior context yeah, of this is. Because I feel like it was put there for drama, but what happened before this? Like, how long did this uh, this, this go on for? Is it a chase or a shooting or? He is not chasing only she is. All right, Randy. A lot of different. Good job. God damn, bro! You look like a whole butt plug. What the fuck is that supposed to mean? Yes. Uh, it's back to the city. Back to the What's city. What's small and pretty? Oh hell yeah. Do you like yeah. my butt? I mean, not bang, bro. You previously had cuffed three people. Maybe three people. Let you hold my pocket, Craig. I mean, it still comes down. It, all, it, it should always come down to, to a similar question: is um, if they've been like running over people, uh, you know, even if they're locals and shit. I mean, if their car is disabled, I don't think shooting them would be the right choice there, to be honest. What should be happening is right now, uh, and this isn't a this isn't a say like it's a fucking rule break or some shit, but what should be happening and should be still trained is whoever is uh, the first on scene should be saying lethal, the second on scene saying non-lethal, and then there's a coordination between other officers to not all have lethals out. That's 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 what should happen ideally, but. I mean, if it's going on for an hour and a half or some shit, it's a little different. Angel warned not to uncuff. We'll be sure. Yeah, but um, even IRL, if I, I don't think a cop would do that IRL. In in, I mean, you know, maybe they would have if they were, like I said, if they were driving on the uh, sidewalk and running people over and shit. Uh, that's a different story. But we don't base it off that, obviously. Our escalation is based off what we we perceive as a deadly threat in our world. So, um, I'd say once the cars are mobile, they're not considered a deadly threat, and they should be used. Uh, it should be lethal force as that step. But like I said, um, I didn't watch the entire thing. They could have been driving on sidewalks, running over AI, ran over cops, done some other dumb shit, and you know, then it's somewhat justified. So. The time frame I don't think really matters. Like an hour sure is like it's crazy, but like I said, it depends what happens in that hour. It's still it's still like the lethal force, in my opinion, has come to a halt when the vehicle that is being used as the deadly weapon is no longer usable. You know what I mean? It's like it's like it's, you gotta consider like this. If I have a gun and I throw it on the ground, I don't get shot anymore, right? Oh, sorry, bro. Sorry, I, bro. And I have my hands up. You know, you know at that point, uh, uh, I'm not lethal, and it should be de-escalated at that point. But in saying that, it's not something that you need to like get your, uh, get your, you know, fucking sand in your vagina over. You know what I mean, Oh, Snow was a hostage. Well, there you go. There, 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 there you go. Um, if if they had taken cops hostage, you would know they've got a weapon on them. And then, you know, at that point, it's... Uh, if it's been an hour, especially, that, that would make sense. So, e e either way, the, the justification for me in this is... Um, the threat. The threat, if the threat is stopped... And, and if you see that clip like that, it can be perceived that the, the, that the threat is still active. Uh, no not active, sorry. Um, but you're only seeing 30 seconds of it. So there you go. If um, if a cop had been taken hostage before, uh, it's 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 logical to shoot at that point then. They can only blame themselves for that. Flippy flipped the car before he died as well. Wait, what? 
and you was gonna get shot well i mean like, like well every time i go into a situation i think other oh, cops gotta shoot me here but usually i'm thinking that and it's based off like where we have done hostile action before uh for instance when there was a shootout over here and i was trying to pick people up i expected to get shot um but but that's the, that's the that's how escalation works right if if there is a deadly threat and it's justifiable and it's not going to be fun spongy the police are fully justified in doing that like the the, the there shouldn't even be a question about it <sighs> so you got you got you you uh your frogs need to remember that um, not every circumstance is exactly the same. So if I just walk up and uncuff somebody, they might not get shot. Uh, and that, and that's, 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 that's normal. It, it completely comes down to what the person that has been cuffed has done and what the person that is uncuffing has been done. Uh, and it sounds like if there's cops hostages or... Back there? Yeah, bro, just chilling. Where did everyone go, bro? Uh, Hutch, uh, had some doggy issues in his head. Okay. Uh, I don't know where Taco is. You want to call Taco? See where they're at? Uh, just call Maltini. They're probably up here, man. I ran into his fat ass up here before, but they just left. I need a pizza, though. You need a pizza? Oh, uh, no. Nah, I'll tie. Um, I don't see if money's in here. They're fucking closed, bro. I actually... I got. Wanna drive, bro? Okay. Um, I mean, tackling a cop is not lethal force. I don't think. Uh, like IRL, if you did it, you could get shot though. Especially if you're wrestling for a gun, but. You've got to remember, guys. Um, our world. Oh, fucking number. I don't have Taco's number. Fuck. Oh, they put me a little soul or something, bro. Um, you got to. If you, 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 people will will assume. Uh, like, sure, maybe nine months ago, uh, you'd get shot for tackling a cop, right? But these days, it's not like that anymore. You, we, we, we're more balanced on our world, I guess, rather than trying to base it off the real world. Um, so in my opinion, and this is, I believe how the, the, the world should work in terms of policing is you only use lethal force if there is a lethal threat currently active. Now, how you justify that obviously is going to be different in every person's mind, but that's the core premise. I think to, um, well, how, how, how the policing should be done. A vehicle can be a deadly weapon. Punching can be a deadly weapon. Uh, tackling could be a deadly weapon if you're tackling somebody off a cliff or, you know, doing some shit like that. Um, it's fucking disappeared, bro. There's, uh, there's a lot of, uh, a lot of things like that that can, um, you know, justify the shooting. Uh, do I have tackle number? Uh, I don't know. Ah, uh, who was they with, bro? Who tackle and who, bro? It was just tackle and Curtis. Well, they probably just chilling, bro. Fuck it. Wanna keep boosting or what do you want to do? Uh, I don't think I got my boost, bro. I look out of my pocket. Uh, 